the reflection of the point 4 comma minus 13 above the line 5x plus 5y plus 6 is equal to 0. Reflection of the point it's like image of the point. So we had a concept if p x1 comma y1 if the line is given a x plus b y plus c equals to 0 then the image of the point image of the point x1 comma y1 under the line a x plus b y plus c equals to 0 if it's given by q alpha comma beta Then we have the relation alpha minus x1 upon a is equal to beta minus y1 upon b is equal to minus 2 times of a x1 plus b y1 plus c upon a square plus b square. So similarly the reflection of the point reflection of the point 4 comma minus 13 under the line under the line 5x plus y plus 6 is equal to 0 so let us consider the point b alpha comma beta so that the image can be given by by comparing the same formula here a is equal to 5 b is equal to 1 c is equal to 6 and x1 is equal to 4 and y1 is equal to Nikki 213. So we have a relation alpha minus 4 upon 5 is equal to beta minus of minus 13 upon 1 is equal to minus 2 times of a x1 that is 5 into 4 plus 1 into minus 13 and plus 6 upon a square plus b square that is 5 square plus 1 square so we can write this as alpha minus 4 upon 5 is equal to beta plus 13 upon 1 is equal to so minus 2 times of this is 20 minus 13 is 7 7 plus 6 13 so 13 upon 5 square is 25 25 plus 1 is 26 so here 13 2 times and 2 to get cancelled so it is negative 1 so alpha minus 4 upon 5 is equal to minus 1 and we can also write beta plus 13 upon 1 is equal to minus 1. So alpha minus 4 is equal to minus 5 and beta plus 13 is equal to minus 1. So finally we can give alpha value is 4 minus 5 and beta value is minus 13 minus 1. So alpha is minus 1 beta is equal to minus 14 therefore reflection of the point can be taken as reflection of the point 4 comma 13 if under the line 5x plus y plus 6 is equal to 0 is minus 1 comma minus 14 so we can go with an option option a is the answer